<laughs> hey, surprise, it's me. Can you guess the theme of today's video? No, I'm not the Devil Guard. I just stole his pajamas. It's me, <laughs> Special Dark Ghoul. Come, have a seat. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I am, a, oops, a little late to the party. <gasps> Gotta fix it. Oh, what did you do? I, do you want to intro the video? Yes, because I don't know if this was a strong intro or That's not. That's not an intro. Uh, that was us do bullshitting. bullshitting. An intro is when you, do you know what an intro is? <laughs> we went over this last time. I've got your intro right here. In my pockets. There, I don't keep anything in here because, oh look, there's a hole in my crotch. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, there's a hole in my crotch too. <laughs> I don't want to know what the devil guard is using this hole oh, for. God. <laughs> this is the last time I put on somebody else's pajamas. <laughs> well, hello, YouTube. It is us, your friends, the nameless ghouls. Today, we're going to share our Papa 5 predictions with you guys. Or at least our hopes and our dreams it's, for the next it Papa is our, era. It is, it's more like headcanon or like Christmas wish list. <laughs> We've been very good this year. And by that I mean very naughty. Yes, of course. <laughs> so we hope to get everything on our wish list because it'll be a very merry new year to come with Papa Five at the helm. So for those of you who are returning, you probably already know our opinions on Papa Four. But if not, we're gonna tell you anyways. Papa Four did not really live up to our expectations because we had really had high expectations because of Papa Three and Papa Two. We just covered how we felt about Papa Two. It was magnificent. Yeah, Papa Two was a very he he was a very epic Papa. I don't know something. He was kind of sinister oh, and so utterly majestic. So yeah, we had Papa Two being absolutely entirely majestic and scary Infernal and then Inferno Majesty and then I'm trying to talk I'm sorry we heard that song today in the car and it was just so good yeah I was like singing that song all day and then he acted like he didn't hear me <laughs> singing it and then it played in the car when we were getting Starbucks and he's like have you heard this song and I'm like bitch I was literally singing that all day I don't know <laughs> what are you talking about I don't know <laughs> It, but neither it, of us remembered what it was called for some reason because yeah. it's been so long since And then I'm like, wait, 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 it's in the song somewhere, just wait. It was like the very last part of the song too, but I'm like, I knew it was there. But anyway, this video is not about that. This video is about Papa, not about the music. <laughs> it's about the, the man. <laughs> the man behind the music. Yes. So we loved Papa 2, and then of course we loved Papa 3. I love Papa 3 because that was when I got into ghost papa three was a good time and he was like very fun he was like he had a lot of sex appeal he looked he really was cool. he was debonair like how i would say that papa two was majestic and sinister papa three is debonair but he also has like that dark mystique about him yeah like a a, a deep mystery like you don't really know quite what to expect from him. And his outfit was so cool. I loved all the gold. It was so and the, gorgeous. And I liked the purple quite a bit. Yeah. <laughs> the gold and the purple was was a great motif. Kind yeah. of like how I enjoy the um, green with the black mm -hmm. for Papa 2. Mm -hmm. And then Papa 1 was just kind of terrifying and he's silly a, looking. He's a cute raisin. <laughs> a cute raisin? He's a cute He's a cute raisin. He's a grumpy grandpa who has who has needed to be dead for 300 years, but it hasn't quite happened for him yet. <laughs> he's like, he wakes up and he gets his coffee. He's like, why am I not dead yet? <laughs> I, we need to do that with like a voice, a grandpa voice filter. Like, why am I not dead yet? <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh my God, where did that come from? <laughs> it sounded like my grandpa. <laughs> Oh my god, that was a really good old man voice. Why? I don't even know if I can do it again. Hold on. Why? No, no, don't hurt yourself. Why am I not dead yet? You're crying tears. Billy, kill your grandpa. 
That one, not as good with that one. I, it's, I need to watch some more South Park. It's been oh, a while. My cheeks hurt from Ow. smiling. My face is so damp under here. Oh my god. <laughs> that was very surprising. <laughs> I didn't know I could do that. Anyways, <laughs> when Papa 4 happened, or when Papa 4 was debuted, well, actually, we weren't there when he was debuted. <laughs> 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 we like we kind of like fell out of touch with ghosts around the time copia happened like before papa 4 was even debuted we kind of didn't like him very much for some reason he was kind of like really stupid and silly and not <laughs> he, what we're used he stole to. <laughs> he stole our vibe <laughs> he copped our vibe yeah <laughs> <laughs> it's like <laughs> You would think that we would like that, but for some reason, <laughs> it was a turn-off. It's like, I'm not scared of you. I see too much of myself in you. Yeah, exactly. I exactly. want to be scared. <laughs> I want to be shaking in my, my Christmas boots. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I can't wait for Christmas, apparently. <laughs> I don't know what I want for Christmas. Okay, this is not a Christmas <laughs> video. <laughs> we need to stay on topic. It's not even been Halloween yet. Yeah. I'm exactly. doing that thing that I get mad at grocery stores for doing. This is not about holidays, it's about Papa. Papa 4 though, I was gonna say I really like his, I really like his outfit though. Like the teal and the, or is it teal or is it blue? I don't know, but I really Cerulean? like- Cerulean? Yeah, Perhaps. I really like Papa 4's Cerulean outfit though. That's uh, like the yes. one thing I really like about him. I think that's cool. I actually liked him in that most recent picture that I saw where he had like the Lestat hair. Oh yeah. Anyways. The Copia Popia era is coming to an end, or supposedly is coming to an end. That's what people are theorizing, because he's been around for a very long time, and this tour is almost over, the Re-Imperator. People are thinking that Papa 5 will potentially be making an appearance soon. Everyone is kind of imagining what Papa 5 might be like. What I'm actually hoping for Papa 5 is, I kind of just want there not to be another papa and i want the next like you know vocalist like the lead singer i kind of want it to just be satan now like i want them to actually have satan on stage singing all the ghost songs and i i kind of want him to be like sexy like the satan from the legend movie because <laughs> he was so freaking cool and i think that having the lead singer to ghost being literal satan would be so badass i can get behind that only i'd like to throw my ingredient into the pot if i may uh mm. satan from south park <laughs> fallen one i am satan would you like to go to hell with me i loved satan from south park big and intimidating but with a soft heart of gold that would be perfect <laughs> honestly i would love to see that and then you know what i Neither of us really liked the ghouls from this uh, Impera era because they kind of look like bugs. It took me a really long time to truly appreciate them to where I am now. It, they're kind of cute and precious in their own way. Yeah, we really didn't like them at first, but we kind of got used to them. <laughs> they're like cute. They're the new, like the Impera ghouls are kind of cute, but I miss when they look like demons. Like, I definitely miss when the ghouls used to look like demons. Yeah, or like the Meliora mask. Like, I mm -hmm. love how they kind of look like gargoyles. It, what would be cool is if the next era of ghosts was a lot more dark. Like, not just Papa and the ghouls, but like everything. Like, a more heavier and darker sound and aesthetic would be so badass. What if they had like skull faces or something? That would be interesting. Yeah, right? I'm not really into skulls, but it could look cool. Skulls with horns would be a p yeah. perfect mixture of those um, classic horror tropes. That's true. It just would be cool if everything felt satanic again and it was... Make ghosts satanic now. I want it more satanic, more blasphemous, more dark, more heavy. That's what I'm, that's what I'm hoping for. But you know what? You don't what? have you don't have to have your own thoughts in this day and age because AI exists. Oh, oh good because I'm so full of no thoughts right now that <laughs> I'm struggling to get out what I think because I'm not thinking. That is precisely why we decided to use AI 
Can, to brainstorm for us. Can I use AI to go in to work for me tomorrow? We're only making AI to do things that we actually like doing, not things we don't like doing. We, we decided we're going to use this AI program to show us what Papa and Meredith's 5 might look like. Uh, we're using Crayon um, because I, it's the only free one that I know of. So. Plus I love crayons. <laughs> yeah. Should we just say Papa okay, Meredith's 5 okay. and see what it thinks yeah, that yeah. it's going to be? Let's see what AI thinks that Papa 5 is going to be. <laughs> okay. This one looks looks totally disturbed. He's oh god! Oh, is he smiling or is he afraid? I can't really tell. Ew! Oh, I actually really like the teeth. Oops. I like how he's got no lips and he's just teeth. Yeah, he looks kind of like a zombie. He's got like really nice, he really nice grills. <laughs> he looks so done with the job. <laughs> he's like, I've put in forty two years. <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> this looks like some insane clown posse shit. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Ew. I hate it. And look at his hands. They're so fucked up. <laughs> look at the extra finger. Oh god. AI loves to, to throw in extra fingers and shit. It looks so gross. <laughs> Why does it make all of them look gross? I don't know. Oh god. This one kind of reminds me of Niall. <laughs> Yeah, only <laughs> sad Nile. Sad Nile. Somebody took his saxophone away. What's with this dinky hat? Un <laughs> it's unimposing, and I cannot get behind that. You know, what? I don't, I don't know about these. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Yes, yes. I will. Whatever this is, I will have it. I'm praying. I fucking love that. <laughs> 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 Freaky. I don't like that. That looks like that's some astral Papa right yeah, there. Yeah, that's like when you're having a nightmare and then Papa Emeritus just shows up. That's the winner, like hands down. Like look, look at his eyes. Like I know. what is he thinking? <laughs> <laughs> Whatever it is, it's troubling him deeply. It is. He's pensive. I think we should do something fun now. All right. So let's see what Papa Emeritus Five is gonna look like on the beach. Okay. I hope they're gonna put him in a bikini. I want to see it. What the? <laughs> Ew! I hate that. That's nightmare fuel. Oh. <laughs> we should put bikini <laughs> in a bikini. We on need the a beach? yeah because that's what. That's I'm what scared. We want. <laughs> we do, do it. Okay. Here oh we go. my god! It looks like you know what that looks like. Ooh. It looks like some like it looks like some woman kissed Papa and the <laughs> paint. Came off on her mouth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's what that looks like. That is what that looks like. Oh, look here. here look. Ooh. He's in a bikini. Look at that <laughs> Oh, look. He's got one of those <laughs> alien skulls. Oh, my God. What the hell? He's got those ancient Egyptian cone no, heads. Oh, I'm crying. That's too funny. He kind of looks like Elvis right there. Yeah, kinda. What the? What's going on? <laughs> is that a- what appendage is that wrapped around his- his love handles? Oh god. <laughs> I'm disturbed. These are just disturbing. What if this new era is gonna be just like AI art? What if he is AI? Oh he's gonna god. have all kinds of extra fingers, extra lumps in his pants because he's going oh to have god. tentacles. You know what? What? I think there was theories about that, like, the next era may actually be, like, futuristic. Well, I mean, that has been strongly hinted at. Yeah. He could literally be a robot. We're gonna try one more thing and see if it can capture what we imagined in our minds. Ooh, should he be eating spaghetti? I'll just say eating, maybe, and it'll just decide what he was wanting That's to eat. true. Whenever I, I ask AI to show me a picture of somebody eating, it's not real food, it's something else. Oh god. He's, he's, pr pray he's praying before the meal, he's blessing the food. <laughs> okay. Our father, which art in hell, has the ketchup and salt. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like, what is that? Is that a scoop of, of, um, that looks like, you know, like the onions that you like to eat. The crispy oh, onions. Oh, yeah. It looks, like a, it looks like Ghoulie's food measuring cup with this crispy onions that people, people's <laughs> aunts put on top of, like, like a green bean casserole for Thanksgiving. Yeah. He's just eating it, just like you. <laughs> and he looks so happy about it. <laughs> he's, he's like, 
I know this is not its intended purpose, but I'm really enjoying my life choices. <laughs> what is that he's holding? It looks like like an anime weapon. Or <laughs> yeah, it does. He's like, he's like, I'm here to kick ass and eat onion fries. What is it called? <laughs> fried onions. I'm here to kick ass and eat fried onions straight out of the measuring cup. <laughs> okay. And nobody can tell me it's wrong. He's just giving a lecture at the dinner table, and nobody's listening to him because they're too busy eating their um, casserole. Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> He's eating his fingers. Ew, that's disturbing. Just a, yeah, right? Are they sausages or fingers? I don't know if we should show that because that looks very graphic and unpleasant. <laughs> <laughs> are those oysters? Is he trying? To, he looks really old, like he's trying to up his libido. He's like, I heard these are aphrodisiacs. <laughs> he's eating the shell and all too. Good source of calcium. <laughs> he looks like he ate the whole damn Thanksgiving himself. He is looking a little. He's bloated. Chunky. Yeah, he's looking yeah, like he looks... really bloated. Good meal, thanks. <laughs> Hate to eat and run, but later's. Well, it seems as if our imaginations are still superior to AI, at least when you're poor. So we do have that going for us. But in the meantime, I do hope that you enjoyed that little demonstration of AI's predictions for Papa Five. Mm -hmm. And should you ever invite him to your Thanksgiving meal, you can expect him to eat all of the fried onions. <laughs> and his fingers. And all of the food on the table, and then just dine and dash. <laughs> So thank you for watching. Be sure to give us a like and subscribe. It super helps the channel. Yes, and we are trying to get to 3,000 subscribers. Because that would be super cool. Thank you. Thank you, friends, for coming. It was lovely having you. All right. This was the last bit of uh, energy I had. Good night.